camera. Who dis? Hey guys, how's it going? For today's video, I am going to be doing a challenge. This is the do your makeup with the opposite hand challenge and Nikki Tutorials just posted this tag video and I thought, you know what, it's Monday. We're gonna chill here in the ugly living room instead of me unpacking. Does anyone else do this? I pack the day before a trip and then I don't unpack until four months later. So instead of unpacking, I'm gonna keep procrastinating and do the makeup tag with my opposite hand challenge. So fun fact, I was kind of ambidextrous as a kid. When I was in second grade, my teacher, Miss Andre, gave me one of those pencil gummy holder things and was like, no, use your right hand. So I was kind of forced to use my right hand. Um, and I haven't really written with my left hand in years. So I'm pretty sure that my left handwriting still looks like a five-year-old's. I don't know, I haven't tried. But yeah, we're, we're gonna see how this goes. So I'm gonna be putting up my hair because you know that anyone who has acne and anyone who uses a lot of foundation, it tends to get in that hairline and that can cause breakouts if you've got acne prone skin. So I've got this nifty, nifty headband here that I use on very full coverage days or very messy days when I attempt stupid stuff like this. And I wear this and use this to keep cosmeticas out of my hair. <laughs> Look at me, stripes and polka dots. Like, I am a trendsetter right now. What's also pretty fun is that I'm going to be playing around with some new products today. Anyways, to start off, I'm gonna zoom in on you. All right, so first things first, this be the skin. I know that you've been requesting a skincare update and I will be bringing you one because my skin has changed a little bit just because of the winter weather. It's gotten a little bit dry and flaky and I've had to switch up my skincare to help me out because I'm literally dealing with oily face plus dry patches of skin. It's the worst. It's like, really? Do we have to do both of these right now? This is not what I wanted for Christmas. So I'm gonna start out with my foundation and I am using the Benefit Play Sticks. I am so excited. These are back. These are amazing. I have loved these for years. I'm going to use this on my pimples and on my blemishes and on my red spots and on my dry spots and on all those spots. I am just going to kind of blend this into my skin. Uh, and I'm just not doing a, oh my God, I totally forgot to use my opposite hand. What kind of a beauty guru are you? <laughs> Let's try this again. Um, so I'm using the Benefit Play Sticks and I am just applying this to the areas that, did, was I using my left hand? Now I don't even know. Wow. Benefit has brought them back for a limited time. It's Sephora. I used to use these all the time when I had the worst of my acne. I love them because they are very, oh, very creamy. You can build the coverage. And if you want a foundation tested video of the Play Sticks, wearing them around for a day and showing you how they hold up, let me know and we'll do it. I am using a Tarte Cosmetics buffing brush, and now I'm finally using my left hand. This is actually not as difficult as I thought. I'm kind of attacking my face a little bit more. I feel like this is not as smooth. Next, it's time for powder. I'm going to use the CoverGirl Clean Matte BB Cream. I did a foundation tested video of this. It's literally $6 at the drugstore. This controls my oil like none other. I sweated and exercised in this. And then I showed you how it held up at the end of the day. So if you haven't seen that, check it out. Um, I choking on CoverGirl. I am going to pat this onto my face. I feel like I'm stabbing myself with this brush. I'm having anxiety because I feel like I'm going to destroy all of these bristles. And there's major fallout from this brush. Who are you? Brush, you and your fallout are not cool right now. Be gone. It's actually brand new. This is from number seven. And this is supposed to be the number one drugstore foundation line in Europe. All right. Let's see if I can, oh, that's a lot of concealer. Well then. All right. I'm just gonna pat this in with my fingers. And I'm also going to use this as an eyeshadow primer because my eyeshadow primer is in a box that you guys and the camera are sitting on. And in order to access that eyeshadow primer, I would have to dismantle this entire setup of you on boxes, which I don't wanna do. And that can be done. Naturally, under eye concealer is meant not to crease, ideally, and be long lasting and, you know, kind of even out skin tone. So it does work very well as a double up for an eyeshadow base. I feel like my fingers are just like pounding on my face like a typewriter. Also, when I play piano, the left hand is the one that does the bass note. So it's like, bum, 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 bum. And then the right hand is like, doo -doo 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 -doo. so it doesn't help that I'm like attacking myself like I do my piano. I feel like I have to go apologize to my piano now. This is the Ablaze palette. This, again, is going to be super pigmented because it is Smashbox. I'm going to take this first color. Ugh. And you guys have a great view of my nostrils right now. Oh yeah. 
Isn't this what you subscribed for? The inside of my nostril? That's what I thought. You know what else is happening? I'm using the brush and like going against my skin. It's scratchy and it hurts. Nobody told me this was gonna hurt. This eye looks okay, but this eye, this eye is like my gray point average right now. It needs help. Next I'm gonna take a blendy brush and I'm gonna pick up this nice golden color. We're gonna blend away all of our imperfections, right? I feel like I have pink eye. Blending away your problems. On an angled brush, I'm going to take this lighter brow color. I'm gonna put that on my brow. If I can hold this thing properly. On a pencil brush, I'm going to take this darker brown color. Oh my God. I feel like I'm four years old. Someone get me some crayons. Well, this eye is doing it for me and this eye is just not having a good day. This eye woke up on the wrong side of the face. All right, I'm gonna take my favorite brow pencil, which is the Benefit Cosmetics Precisely My Brow Pencil, and we are going to use this um, to color this onto our face. Oh boy, oh boy. And it's like I have nothing to rest my hand on, so I'm like shaking all over the place. Guys, this is not good for my anxiety. As if acne wasn't enough, right? You know, it would be so sad is if my eyebrows turned out better than when I do my eyebrows with my dominant hand. Like, they look good on their own. Individually, it's just together that they just don't get along. This one just thinks she's too cool for school, and this one just loves Nike a little too much. All right, next we're going to go into eyeliner. I am using the Wonderland Eyeliner from Ciate London. This is a gel coal eyeliner, and I'm using it because it's super creamy and easy to work with. Um, you see, I, I tried to do myself a favor here. If I just hold this still and move my head back and forth. Ow! Dear fingers, why you no have dexterity? Now it's time for liquid liner. This is actually a dotting liner from L'Oreal. It's only a couple bucks at the drugstore and it actually has this cool little dotting tool on it. So you can use it as a regular eyeliner or you can use it to create dots and fun stuff. Not bad. This side, I am handling pretty well emotionally. Well. There go my hopes and dreams for the future. We're just gonna go for this Amy Winehouse look today. For winter. Fudge, no! No! You should have stopped while you were ahead, Cassandra. Stop while you're ahead. See, now this is the point of the video where Cassandra gets frustrated and starts throwing more things and saying bad words. <laughs> and blames all of her shortcomings on a second grade teacher. <laughs> Come on, make my liner sharp enough to slice my enemies. No! Blend that concealer in. See, this side is manageable, but this side is just like going on a wild adventure by itself. If you're planning on doing this challenge, I would highly recommend doing your eyes first, then going in with foundation and concealer. All right, well this is where we're at and I'm just gonna stop while we're ahead. And before I move on to mascara and things, I'm gonna try to do the rest of my face to give my eyes a little bit of a break because they're like ready to bleed. For my cheeks, I'm using a limited edition holiday collection, the Lights Collection from Smashbox. Oh my god, I look like I am coloring in a coloring book. Oh boy. Rub you in these big awkward circles until you look normal. Face, do you look normal yet? No. How about now? No. 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 For my highlight, I'm using this Makeup Forever color. This is the Pro Light Fusion. So it's got kind of like this holographic pearlescent look to it. Obsession. Now that we're doing my nose. 
and attempts to be beautiful and highlight that ish. And I know that we've spoken about this before in videos, but never highlight over places you have acne. Highlight selectively. Now I need blush, and I don't have any blush, but thank God my suitcase is right here. And I have not unpacked for my last trip, so I still have my travel makeup. This is an old palette from Tarte Cosmetics, but Tarte is always cruelty free, and they always have beautiful blushes. So I'm gonna take this nice color, tap off that excess. Ooh, that's a lot of excess. I'm just gonna try to swipe this along my cheeks. This is brand new. This is the Ariana Grande Viva Glam 2. This goes to the AIDS Fund, and you know that I'm all about that charity life, and I just stabbed myself. Congratulations, Cassandra. You can't even hold products with your left hand. Who trusted you with this? And I'm just gonna kinda do this. If I keep the movement in my head, then it's a little bit easier than if I just try to color with my fingers. Is my name Ariana Grande yet? Can I please have a world tour? Thank you. Next, I'm going to be applying a glossy liquid lipstick. Just because I'm not loving the way that this color is turning out. Um, this is a limited edition collection for holiday from Pure Cosmetics. Like, let me just say, and this is reminding me a lot of the Kylie lip kits. Only these are fully filled. Not half filled. <coughs> Kylie Jenner. This is Queen of Hearts. This one, ooh, I am liking this metallic sheen. This one is called Queen of Hearts and it's supposed to be a hydrating liquid lipstick. Especially since my skin and everything right now has been so dry. Cassandra, you should not attempt to talk and put on lipstick with your non-dominant hand. That is a very stupid idea. You guys are great together. You should do this more often. I always apply my lashes with tweezers. Seeing as I'm using my non-dominant hand, that sounds like a very bad idea. So I am just gonna do this with my nimble fingertips. Jack be nimble, Jack be quick. Jack apply eyelashes and make them stick. As we wait for these to dry, I am going to go in with my mascara. This is the Colossal Big Shot Mascara from Maybelline. I'm just gonna balance my arm on my knee. Since I'm sitting on the floor like a boss. Why won't you all just please go in the same direction? That's all I ask of you. No! 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 All of my hard work. Now, this is my bindi. This is my bindi. All right. Just from the dark side. This eye is just not my friend. Look at this, I just, I just destroyed this eye. You've gotta like hold them just right. I'm only using little lashes cause I thought that that's all I would need, but I now wish that I had a gigantic set of lashes on hand to just cover all of these mistakes. You know, this eye is honestly not that bad. It's this one that's just not, just didn't wake up on the right side of my face today. Now that this is dried, I'm gonna try to take something and like scrub it off. Oh my god, I can't even get this off my skin. Maybelline, why do you make such great products? Don't you know it's ruining my makeup challenge? Well, all right, a little bit more of that play stick. All right, well this is where we're at. I did not think it would be that hard, but I also am actually pretty impressed with this side of my face. Like, this side of my face is doing it for me. I'm looking good. This side of my face, no cigar. Next time you're doing your makeup, do this with your opposite hand. Like, you need to try this. I mean, if we just look at the glass half full, if we just look at the face half gone, I'm also working on that digital magazine, so that will be coming soon. Articles, science, acne, and of course, the limited edition jewelry collection is still available. Uh, my cats love it, and I know this because I saw my cat walking away with one of my necklaces as if this was a mouse that my cat just caught. I was like, felony, you give that back to me right now. But if my cat likes it, you know my cats have good taste. And there's $20 off as the little holiday sale and promotion. So live beautifully, I love you guys. You are beautiful inside and out, even if the outside ends up like this side of my face. But I post new videos every Monday, Thursday, and now Saturday for Skin Science. So be sure to subscribe so you don't miss it and like this video for effort. A for effort. And L as in like this video for left hand. Oh yeah. Anyways, I love you guys. Always remember to be beautiful and I will talk to you all in the next video. <laughs> love you guys.
Bye.